Hi guys. Well, I started recording a video taking this apart, but I forgot I already had footage on here, and uh, I had the camera sitting on there, so I wasn't watching the screen, and uh, it stopped recording just a couple of minutes in, so I lost several minutes worth of dismantling this, so I just deleted and started again. So, I'm just going to talk through what I've done. I've got the wheels off, got the motor off, motor's off, headlamp is off, and bracket, horn is off, the chain is in here somewhere, there's the chain, see it, there's surface rust on that, that'll um, clean up and soak it all nicely, um, so apart from moving, from moving, apart from removing the little throttle switch, this part of the handlebar, because this actually slides out, so I'm going to undo that. Probably undo this, yeah. And then that should pull out. And then I can think about undoing all that when the bar's off. That is just an Allen key in there. Yeah, remove those. Remove the actual handlebars from down there. And it's good to go. To be packed away and probably sat in the outside cupboard. And uh, to to await, I should say, um, the rebuild. Okay, maybe I've got to take this little black screw thing out all together. Another one. More like probably not. Um, if not, the only option I've got is to drill up. To be drilled, I'm afraid. That's pissing me off. Just going to put me a bit behind. Um, I'm a cordless drill and a dinky little.
Hey, real quick. miniature bolt for a um, suspension um, suspension mountain bike there we go so um, I've just got a little bit twisted but I think I'll just leave it at that for now so there we go job's done well, that's ready and I've made a bit of room in the outside cupboard because uh, well, I've just got to stack up a couple of wheels and get that footstool out. Because uh, I need to go in my big yellow tub in there to grab a um, five-speed freewheel. And now I've got several in there. I need one to put back on the back wheel on my blue mountain bike out there. Uh, uh, oh, pardon me. Once that sun has come round this side far enough, so it's not glaring down on my shed and oh dear, making me sweat my tits off, I'll uh, go down there and sort the car boot stuff out and try and stack it up so I can get some more in there. Um. Oh. I've just 
realised that the footage I took off this camera before I started this that I don't need. So I was going to start again today. So I might as well have just deleted it. Oh well, I'll delete it off the PC later. Um, so yeah, that's my scooter. The master just got to take the front forks out and grease up any bearings before I stick them all back in, obviously. But that leaves me with the frame to scrub down and repaint. Look, that's only going to be done with hammer, right? I'll get a cheap pack of uh, paint brushes and do that. Um, I don't think I'm going to get all the rust off the chrome. It might end up looking a bit pitted. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that yet. That's an easy thing to do. That is just dust on that, so I'll just polish that when I can remember. Oh no, never mind. It's over there on the computer. I was just going to look for me um, furniture polish. Um, I'll get this shithole cleaned up before my friend from France arrives. I know he's not going to be here till the 13th of August, but that's only like a couple of weeks away, and I'd like to get as many of the um, jobs done that I've got to do. Um, my black folding shop that I put all the funny gear on, like the mountain bike wheels and the stunt pegs and that one, I'm going to break that up and scrap it. I can't be asked with any more. And the fact it's pissed me off because I keep tripping over it in the shed, I keep tripping and getting the bloody stunt pegs caught on everything, so that can go on a scrap heap. It's pissed me off too much. Once I've taken the wheels out because I want the wheels. I want the wheels. And... Well, that and the fact that I've got another use for the wheels anyway. When I go to my friends and just pick up a, another kid's bike frame. It's a nice bike frame, but it just needs wheels. Uh, anyway, that's it for this video. So, the next stage will be um, repainting the chassis and cleaning up the chrome as best I can. I could clean it up and uh, just paint the chrome a different colour, I don't know yet, I haven't decided. Uh, ooh, pardon me. Um, find some batteries and away it'll go. So, yeah, stay tuned. Bye bye for now.